Well, good morning, DCO Nation. Welcome back to another video. My name's Chris. I'm with Deadcom Outdoors. If this is your first time tuning into the channel. Um, today, we are going to be out in Merle's Inlet. Uh, it is, I don't even know if the sun is even up yet. I can't tell because it's cloudy. It's overcast. It is cold. I've got a heavy jacket on today. But uh, we're going to go out and see if we can't get on a trout bite. I went out yesterday and um, picked up two nice trout kind of at the end of the day it was some pretty tough fishing yesterday um but check out this footage man check out these two trout that that i picked up there we go fish on fish on that's nice fish what do we got here it's a red no, it's a beauty of a trout. Beauty of a trout. Yeah. Let's throw them on the board real quick. He is 16 and a half. Beauty. 16 and a half inch trout. He nailed it too. That's a keeper, but we are going to let him go. There he goes. Awesome, you guys. There we go, fish on. Fish on, guys. Another nice trout. Another nice trout. Right here in this creek. And this little TRD is getting her done. Boy. Guys. He's even bigger yet. He is even bigger yet. He spit the little TRD. Guys, another nice trout. Back to back beauty of a fish right there probably about the same so those trout were almost carbon copies of each other they were probably the first one i measured it was 16 and a half the second one i'm assuming was about the same probably 16 17 inches so uh we're gonna go out we're gonna fish for about three hours or so four hours it's gonna be kind of a short day uh i want to go home want to catch some football so, uh, guys, let's get on a bite today. Here we go. All right, y'all. I'm going to throw a little shrimp pattern. Uh, the shrimp is still in here. I'm seeing them bounce up around the grass here. So this is the Power Prawn Junior from Salt Strong. I got a little Dr. Juice on it. And uh, the... Eighth ounce is going to give it a little bit of a slower fall. And we're just going to work right along this grass line. There we go. Fish on. Fish on. It's trout. Good trout. Good trout. Okay. There we go. All right. All right. A little trout. See where he is. So, got to be 14 to be legal. He's 13 and a half. 13 and a half inch trout. Power prong. Decent. There he goes. There we go, fish on, fish on. Another little trout. Good. A little better. Ooh, he threw it. All right. I'm about ready to put the net out there. Can't really, 
count that as a catch, can we? Nah, probably not. <laughs> we saw him though. There we go, fish on. Didn't even hardly feel him. Yeah. Stay down. There we go. Didn't even feel him. <laughs> Little small one. Yeah, right, just a little small one. <laughs> there he goes. Keep working this shrimp just right off of this. There's some oyster and then it goes down to a little bit of a deeper trough. You don't have to set the hook real hard for trout. Their mouths are so soft, if you just reel, they'll hook themselves. If you do a hard hook set, you can rip the hook actually out of their mouth. Just keep pressure on them. You just can't beat a shrimp. I had a couple of videos, which I'll put right up here. Everything eats a shrimp everything Let's put on some more dr. juice start to run out bang got him Another nice trout right down there. Nice head shaker, stay down. Stay down. Yeah. Good. And you can see he's already come off. The hands are still nice and wet. Another little small trout, maybe 12 inches. There he goes. Every time I put that Dr. Juice on, I hook right up. Scent may be another big key today. I didn't even hardly move that shrimp. We are going to, oh, look at all that shrimp. Man, now I know why they're hitting. I just saw a bunch of shrimp right underneath me. And it was all about the same size and color of the power prawn. So now I know why I'm getting on such a good bite. I've matched the hatch without a doubt. That was, that was awesome. There we go, fish on, fish on. That almost feels like a flounder. It is a flounder. Got us a flounder this morning, guys. Little small flounder here, picking them up off the mud bank. Nice. Little small eight, 10 inch flounder. There he goes. All right. Not bad. We're gonna throw on some gulp. We're gonna do this four inch swimming mullet and chartreuse. And I've got a eighth of an ounce trout eye and we're gonna See if scent doesn't make a little bit of a difference here. 
So we'll get him rigged on. right into some pinfish or something there we go fish on guys fish on a lot of head shakes this may be a nicer trout it is a nicer trout okay no bluefish hey bluefish all right cool that's a species we haven't caught yet today. Yeah, a little blue fish. Bang. Yeah, species we haven't caught. Today he's out of here. Gone. Not a bad day on the water. Four, four or five trout, um, flounder, and that one little blue fish, which uh, that was always fun to catch. I haven't caught one of those in a while. But um, the keys to today, what I thought was one, you know, I matched the hatch. I saw the shrimp, and so the Power Prawn Junior, right off the bat, was um, was catching the trout. Uh, there was a couple times where I didn't even twitch it and the trout were hitting it. So definitely finding the bait and what the abundance of the bait was in that area, which in this case was shrimp. Um, so guys, the outgoing tide was productive. It was a good day and I really appreciate everybody. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and um, guys, I'll see you out on the water. Have a great day.